On this episode of At The D Spot, we're making a delicious cream of chicken rice soup. Let's go. For a full list of ingredients, be sure to check the description box below. As some of you may know, I'm originally from Chicago. And on Sundays, every breakfast restaurant or diner in the city features their cream of chicken soup and everyone has their own recipe and take on it. So here's mine. First, we're gonna start off with our vegetables and I'm gonna chop our half onion. Next, on to the carrot. Now it's time to chop our celery. We take our stock pot, we light our slow to medium heat. We're gonna add a couple of tablespoons of olive oil. Now it's time for us to add our onion, carrot, and celery. We're gonna sweat these veggies down for about five minutes. I didn't add any garlic, salt, or pepper because I add that to my chicken stock. So I'm not gonna salt or season this until the end because there's already salt and seasonings in some of the ingredients. I'm adding six cups of my homemade chicken stock. You can look in the description box below to see how I make mine. Or you can use any store-bought chicken stock of your choice. Next, we had our chicken breast, and this is just some chicken that I roasted, a chicken breast that I roasted when I made my stock. Now we're adding our rice, our basil, and there goes our bay leaf. Just gonna give all this a stir. Now that we've added our ingredients to our stock pot, we're gonna let this boil for about 15 to 20 minutes and we'll be right back. In this bowl, we have one can of evaporated milk to which we're gonna add one tablespoon of cornstarch to make a slurry to add to our soup to make it nice and thick. Next, it's time to add our evaporated milk cornstarch slurry. And add half a cup of cream. This already smells incredible. And just for an extra little bit of fragrance and vibrance, I'm adding a little bit of fresh lemon juice. About a tablespoon and a half. This soup will thicken up as it goes. We're gonna lower our heat to low. We'll cover it and we'll give it another 15 minutes. You wanna open it up every few minutes and just give it a little bit of stir. You see how it's starting to thicken up a little bit. I'm just adding chicken and rice to my soup, but you can add any kind of vegetables that you like. You can add potatoes, you can add corn, mixed vegetables. You can leave the chicken out if you want to. It's your soup, make it however you like. You know I won't be mad at you. Beautiful, creamy, rich soup. 
just gonna give it a few more minutes. Now that our soup has been boiling for a bit, we're gonna give it one taste and make sure that we don't need to add any additional seasoning or spices. Perfect. Okay everyone, our cream of chicken rice soup is done. My kitchen smells insanely delicious and I can't wait to try it. I have to try this again. Mmm, guys. Creamy, rich, not too thick, not overbearing. Beautiful chicken flavor throughout the whole thing. The rice is really nice. It gives it a good substance and heartiness to it. This soup is great to have a cup of soup with a, a sandwich, a salad. If you're gonna have this soup as a main entree, some nice fresh bread, you cannot go wrong. I guarantee you that if you make this, you and whoever you make it for is gonna absolutely love it. Thank you for tuning into this episode of At The D Spot. I'm Danny, and remember, be good to one another. We're all connected. Until next time. If you enjoyed this video, remember to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell, and tell everyone about At The D Spot. Come and go with me. Tastes like a Sunday morning in Chicago.